Hi there. Eric Whitehead, Untamed Feast Wild Mushroom Products. Today we're harvesting the elusive and abundant today King Belitis, Porcini mushroom, as they say in Italian. Porcini. I have an Italian friend out here with me today who's going crazy. He's just, he can't believe it. The biggest flush I've ever seen here in my secret little spot. Uh, why don't we clean some of these up? So, when they come up in the fall rains, when it's really nice and uh, the air starts to cool, you get these beautiful Belitis mushrooms. And Belitis, they don't have the gills, they just have a sponge there. How the spores are ejected a different way. Now, but we're more interested in the gourmet taste of these. The porcini mushroom is one of the most widely consumed uh, edible wild mushrooms in the world. Europe is in love with this mushroom. Let's try a little piece here. Mm. It's very simple. It's very soft. Almost melting in your mouth, but firm. And it's... It just tastes like you the woods and it's rich and complex. These I put into my bucket here, which I'm keeping the rain out because it's a dark and windy day today. So I clean these by slicing the stem, cleaning off any dirt and debris, and at the same time I'm I'm inspecting it for any insects. And I have a little rag here. I'll wipe it down. The cleaner I can get this mushroom out of the bush, the easier it is for me to slice it up and dry it and uh, put it in a little package for sale for, to you. Now, porcini mushroom is, is, is good raw. It's one of the few mushrooms that you can actually eat raw in a salad, in a tomato salad, and some nice diced fresh porcini. But you'll rarely come across enough fresh porcini to enjoy. Um, I prefer drying the mushroom for a variety of reasons. One of those reasons is that it concentrates the flavor of the mushroom. It's, uh, it's a very nice taste, but it is somewhat bland like this. However, when it's dried, it is it's ooh, ooh, very aromatic and flavorful and makes fantastic soups and gravies, risottos, uh, anything for pasta or in, into mushroom soup very versatile mushroom, very unique, uh, mild, sweet flavor. So I'm going to clean all these. So here's one here that probably has some worms in it. You can see the worms are getting to it. You have a look. Yeah, and you'd find, although the meat is nice and white, there are worms starting to infect this mushroom. So that, unfortunately, will be garbage. Let's go see. Let's go pick one. Let's go pick one. Yes, the wild and woolly rainforest of BC. Oh, I had one all picked out here. Here it is. Look at this beauty. Look at it. Oh, that's a beautiful mushroom right there. Beautiful. Hello, little mushroom. Hello. We're going to add a little wild to our plate tonight, like we did last night. We're going to add a little wild to our plate and have an untamed feast. I hope you enjoy this video. And... Thank you for uh, being whoever you are and enjoying fine food.